Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Mini Motorways. This week we're trying the weekly challenge because uh, it seems really tough. But I've got an idea in mind, and I think we can make it work. So we only get one bridge and unlimited road tiles, but no other upgrades. So no tunnels, no additional bridges, no extra, well we'll have a million roads, but no motorways, no nothing. So definitely something that we're going to have to keep an eye out for, but it's not impossible. The other thing, everything's circles, so, you know, demand will be crazy, and the trees can't be removed, and I already know a couple that I'd like to remove, but anyway, let's jump into it and see, let's see how we can do. Very interesting start. Okay, so let's just pause right off the bat. So we've got trees here, we've got trees here, and we did get a pretty good start because I wanted this area open, and I'll give you the idea right out of the gate. What we need is basically these three to be open at all times. Now, I don't know about this part, and I don't know about the left and the right, but we need to have three roads going through here. One bridge and three of these. That's my current strategy. So let's see if we can make that work. Now, I say that because we usually get a blue spawn here, and then a... Oh. <laughs> Yolo, why are you over there? Um, I was going to say that we get blue spawns over here. So, blue houses, blue traffic. Now, this is a little interesting, because I wasn't expecting to have to immediately change my mind here, but we can add that in. That's not a big deal. It'll be a little bit slower, but the idea is the same. We want to bring these up and follow the coast. There's the blue, actually, and it's it's in a very weird spot. Usually it's not... I should have actually blocked this off. Maybe... Okay, yeah. I think this is worth a restart. Hold on, because this is... The start of this one is definitely going to be how you get into the top scores. So same idea. We'll do that. We'll do this. Whoops. Do this. Bring it all the way across. And do this. These trees are probably blocking the yellow spawns. And I know I want this to be blue later. So we'll block that as well. And just do a crosshatch here. Do you hear that, like, humming noise? It's, it really doesn't like that I paused on this note. Okay, so here we go. Let's... Let's get past that note. There we go. Okay, so now we've got yellow spawning here. That's so much better. So I think I'll just slowly move these off, and then I can start opening this up, I think. Like I said, this is the very important start, so I'm not rushing this one. I'm just gonna keep the left mouse button held down, and we'll try and figure it out as we go, but we really just need to be careful about these kinds of spawns. Red will be over here soon, and you can already see this is starting to tax it. That's the danger of this one. So there's the upgrade up, okay? And what we can also do, now that we have this, we can bring this down and over. That'll connect this. Ideally, I want the blue to spawn down here, probably. So let's open that up. Hopefully we can get that spawn. Maybe even, like, cut this road like this, so it kind of just follows the tree line. That opens up more space. Yep, turn around. <laughs> that's, blue that's blue territory now. There we go. Awesome. Okay. Not the best. I would have liked it if it was, like, flipped the other way, but not the worst thing in the world. In fact, we could probably bring it this way and up through here. So then there's a bit of traffic jam here, but that's not terrible. It's, it's doable. We can even do something like yellow down. This becomes the blue road. And we want to bring these uh, probably all the way around. Blue's going to have a lot of trouble with these trees, so I really want to make sure that this is properly set up for blue. And then this will become a straight through right through here. So that'll slow down the closer population, but uh, we need a bit of... We need as little interruption after this huge loop as possible, so that's what we're going to do there. And then down here, I want to make it so blue spawns in here. And I'll put in the road like that, because I don't want a blue to spawn there. There we go. <laughs> There's a method to my madness, I swear. I swear there is a little bit of method. I don't know how much method, but we'll see how this goes. Cool. So now we have a blue down there. We can hook that in. And you can see we've got a bit of a, a wonky setup, but it's working. Um, where's my... Oh yeah, there's no more rewards. <laughs> I was like, why is the week not ending? Cool. Alright. There's red. There's a blue. Wow. Okay, so that's super good. That... I couldn't have planned that better. <laughs> now, the other thing... This needs to be cut a little bit closer. So yellow gets a little bit of a break. We want to get blue 
like that, okay, and we've got this one extra tile here for red to come in like that. Now the reason why I put this bridge in here, it's very important because there's another red population that spawns over here. And I need that connected because this is the only red spawn usually. Ooh, uh, that's less than ideal. We need the reds connected, so uh, we can just do that. These are the extras, so it won't really impede traffic too much. Red's more important in this map. This is the, like I said, this is the only red location, so all of the traffic has to go there. This is the start that I wanted. When I envisioned this map, this is exactly, oh, uh, <laughs> well, we can make this work actually. So we'll go around these trees. We can't break them, but we can definitely use them. Then we don't need this. And in fact, we can probably run, yes, we can run red this way instead. And then these reds come up through here. I don't think we'll need more blue. Uh, we might need a little bit, but I think it'll spawn in here instead. Now for this, we hook this in like that. There's the local population, and I'll have to see if that's enough, but we can also run a road all the way around like this. And I think that is gonna be the case, or it'll be something like this. It might be this, and then wait for more yellow. And again, we wanna like, <laughs> the thing about this one is definitely gonna be Get the roads in early because you can't get past these trees. So like this, these two are actually super ridiculous because there's a cream population that spawns down here and then the actual destinations are up there. It is cutting this off a little bit. So I think this bridge is out. I want to keep the road just in case. But then this will become this road, just like that. That'll be for green. That'll be for something. <laughs> I'm not sure. That's enough yellow there, cool, okay. So that's good for the rest of the game. This one is already ticking up, so we will need to put in this yellow line that I was talking about. And it'll feed in through here. And it's really good that it's spawned like this. We can actually siphon as we need it. So let's say we need, I'm gonna think we need probably four. Yeah, probably four, four makes sense. And we'll send those along. They'll take a long route all the way over to here. And that's the second line. Like there's only three tiles of space we can have in here. So we've got blue on one, yellow on the other, red here. In the future, I think it'll be yellow up here. Oh, that's perfect, awesome. Uh, not gonna use it though, I'm just gonna kind of build out the roads. Perfect, <laughs> that's, that's actually not the best, but I'll take it. The problem with this is that we now have only two pathways through here. So we've got the one here, no tunnels, so we can't go through here. So there's this one and uh, this one. So yeah, we're gonna need one for the dark blues that spawn. So that'll be this road. And then the cream will have to take this road that is also used by yellow, which is a bit of a problem. <laughs> Definitely not the best case scenario. But we'll see where we get more yellow. Hopefully it's more on this road, uh, preferably on the left side. No, it's gonna be over here. Okay, so let's block all this off because we don't need any more up here. Like, we just, we just don't. <laughs> Actually, we'll block all of this. I don't need any yellows over there, just over here. Now, the other concern that I have is that a blue, yeah, <laughs> uh, as I speak, it happens. Uh, the blues are gonna wanna spawn soon. So that will have to be this population splitting somewhere. It might even have to just be a double population. Maybe with this one spawning down here, I can open up this and bring this up instead. We'll keep this road present, yep. So then these can still go down there if we need it. And I might even just keep this road like that. Yep, that's good. Open this up. Hopefully we don't get any, maybe I'll leave one road just so we don't get like a, a weird spawn. And I don't know if this will, this might not hold for long. So hopefully we can get more yellow pushed somewhere else. Otherwise we'll have to do some thinking. But for now that works. I want to have to put this road in, there we go. Bit of blue, okay, oh, I forgot to connect this, <laughs> whoops. Okay, so we'll just do the first two. That'll hold pretty well for a while. We'll see how that goes. Bit of blue over there, okay. Maybe I can make like a, a blue and dark blue line that comes up through here, something like this, and then a little bit of a slowdown there. They can ride this wall maybe, and then come down over like that. Actually, you know what? It needs to, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. 
real rough. <laughs> this isn't going to be fun. But I want to put in this infrastructure early, and then... Actually, this will be... This needs to be cream, dark blue. So we'll do this blue onto that line, which will slow down this, but that's... Uh, maybe I bring it down lower. Yeah, and then this comes in like that. These can go all the way past this, so there's less interruption. And then into here. Uh-huh. <laughs> and we'll have to keep an eye on this. It's at three pips, and it looks like it's going to need more yellow houses. Green down there. Oh boy, okay. So we did get the green spawn in here. Uh, is it rework time already? Oh, it's only 200 points. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so green can go here, through here, down to here. So then it's yellow green. Can make it yellow green blue. <laughs> Let's make it yellow green blue. Like that. And put in a road around here. Actually, no, we don't need the road. We just need this. Actually, we do need a road, yeah. Cream needs to link onto that later. Yep. Oh boy. <laughs> and I think I can start pulling this back, because if I can get blue to spawn here, one here and then up through here, that would be good. I think it's good. These are still doing well over here, but it's looking like it's running out as well. I think... Let's see, blue, yellow... Yeah, this needs to connect down here, so it'll be a, a group population of yellow here. There's the greens, yep. There's some blues, okay. So if we get a couple more blues, we can definitely split this. Make it so that these go up like we, <laughs> like I originally planned it to. I think that's actually something we want to do post haste. So these come up like that, and then this doesn't need to be connected here. So then it's just yellow here, just green. A little bit messy at this junction. Uh, maybe I can find a better way to do this. Oops, uh, the green goes like this. Hopefully that's... I'm going to even block this off. I don't want green spawning in there anymore. Blue over there. Okay. Let's get that road in super quick. I almost got blocked right there, so that's good. We have that in. Uh, yeah. We'll have to see how that shapes up. Might be just that, and then flip this. See if we can force more blues to spawn in there. And then over here, I want to put in another road. Because there's a lot of trees in here, and I, <laughs> I don't I don't trust them. Actually, we should put in two roads. One for this, yellows, and then dark blues. Might even go up here and just like... Ooh, that's super good. Uh, Can we use it? How are they getting down there? They aren't. Okay. Can we use that? Can we make like a green group? Let's see. I hope so. If we get more down here, that'd be ideal. Because right now, you can see here, like, that's a lot of traffic. <laughs> it's doing fine. Okay, so I think we're stable. There's the creams. Okay. We planned for this. Uh, but then plans changed. But I think it'll still be this, and then... Get them onto this line, somehow. Maybe this goes away, and then this comes down... Through here? That makes sense. And it should keep popping creams in here. Hopefully. <laughs> Just keep throwing creams on that line. They'll come up through here, mostly doing nothing other than driving. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yes. Okay. Ooh! That's a weird blue spawn. Uh, that that might actually... <laughs> that might be a run-ender, to be honest. But we can make it work. We're getting more blue in here. I think it's worth disrupting the red a little bit, so I can put in this, like, sneaky line. Because then... I can cut here and add two more to this, and then cut here. So then it's just this bit, and then these go over here instead. Uh, don't want them to cross traffic to get here, so I'd rather them go up. Jam, so we want to keep that in mind. If you can avoid the left turn, you, you really should. So we'll put that in. Hopefully we get like a dark blue spawning in there. That would be pretty awesome, actually. And if we get more blue... Ooh, okay. I might even do this. So these come in onto this line? Yeah, 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 yeah. So then this line can almost service this by itself. 
just like that. And then this road doesn't need to exist. Yeah, let's do that. See how that works. Bit of blue there. Okay, that's that's free. <laughs> that's perfect. I love that. Yellow. Okay. Uh, okay, well, this one's good for this. Yellow cross map, though, is not good. So I need to <laughs> I need to figure out how to get this set up. What I can do is hook this in here. <laughs> that's so messy already. And we need more yellow. Oh my goodness. The blessed yellow. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Okay, so then we can bring this up through here before this cuts itself off. There we go. Close proximity cream. Now, the one thing that is a problem with this is that we still need to fit dark blue. Like, dark blue spawns up here. Yeah, I think I might want to put in, like, a little tri-intersection here, and then dark blue is going to have to fly through here, yeah. So, let's put in the road preemptively. It's either going to spawn here or up here. If it spawns up here, then I can make it work, but down here I want to get prepared. <laughs> I think that's good. I think we are set. We're going to probably... There's the dark blue. Okay, yeah. So I think the way to get to 1250 in this is probably blocking this off. Yeah. Let's do this. If we blocked off this or made it so it spawned closer, that's just ideal. But I think the people that do like 1200 plus on this one, they're probably blocking dark blue spawns entirely. Like they just make it so the map doesn't spawn it over here. And then they're set. But I think we can make this work. So that goes there. This can pop in together like that. And we're getting close to being able to service this without this long line, which is super good. These can then be put under that, and then uh, probably this... Let's do this preemptively. Like, they're going to be kind of annoyed, but <laughs> whatever, dudes. This goes there instead. Uh, this pops there, and then... Let's actually cut here. I want this closer to this. Kind of like that, because I think more cream can spawn in here, and then I'll put a road like that. Okay. Looking good. This is still good. I, I need to keep an eye on this blue down here because it is just being serviced by two. But I think these will eventually add on to it. But this one is now good. It's set up long distance, which is a problem. But now this can go onto this, so this is better served. These two are better served, I should say. I could even put in a slip road here. So then if they're coming up from here, I could even do one here. <laughs> That's even better, I think. So then there's a faster path from these down to here. I think that's better. We'll see. I'm trying to keep this green line pretty clean. Don't know how well it's going to work. Okay, that's super good. That's not good at all. Uh, can we fix this super quick? I think we can. These go like this and then through here and then this needs to go around, I think. We can do an interruption, but this is already long distance, so I, I don't think we can survive if we do that. Well, you know what? It's probably, it's probably fine, he said. Probably fine. And there's no more greens on this line, yeah, so just assume that we can get enough, and it's probably enough. Now the other thing over here, I think I can shimmy this line so that one extra layer of green can spawn. So we can do this, then spawn here like that, and then cut here. And then cut here. So then we can get, what, two more two more greenhouses? <laughs> sure. Why not? Actually, I think I want to put them on a little higher of a line, something like this. So we'll have the green line come up, and then the blues can fit in here if they want. That's probably better. One less house. Uh, oh, we could actually do up here. Yeah, this red is pretty good. I don't feel too concerned about it anymore. So the reds that would spawn up here, uh, I'm not too concerned. I might open it up now. Yeah, let's just do that. See what spawns up here. Maybe put one in like that, because I don't want <laughs> I don't want weird stuff. That looks really good, actually. I think we're on our way to a, a high score <laughs> in one of the biggest brain puzzles I've had to do. Like, there's been a lot of thinking that goes into this. Ooh, this, these two right here. Uh, um, mm -mm. Like, if I cut here, let's just theory craft. If I cut here, oh, cream can't go. So this road has to stay. <laughs> Uh, I think these greens will just be servicing this side of the map, and this one will just have long distance green. Maybe I can keep this one for other things. Yep. Random red, okay. Not useful. 
This blue, not useful either. I guess I could put it onto this line, but these ones are closer, so I don't really want to do that. This intersection right here is already getting really messy, so I think this will be where we die. <laughs> like, just as, a, as an aside, I think that's where we're going to die. Maybe I can... Ooh, that's good. Okay, so we might not need yellow on this side anymore. Is there any disconnections I can make? No, yellow's pretty segmented, actually. This one's still good, this one's still good. Looks like blue is still not pulling from these reserves, which is really good to see. Yellow is pulling down. Okay, that's good. Um, see, this distance is already an issue. Like, dark blue is pulling all of the population that we have. I think I'll even... I want to expand this out by one more, I think. Just like that. I cut this road. Expand. And then it's a more of a more of a triangle. Green down there is good. That's really bad. <laughs> That's so bad. Oh no. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, I'll take the blessing, which is the green. The green is a blessing. Put that onto that. But cream over here. Um. Actually, you know what? If we get more cream up here, which we might, this could work. Let's. Try and force it. There's no more space down here, so cream will have to spawn here, yeah. Let's put a road like that, and then there. This just popped yellow? It did, yeah. <laughs> oh no. Uh, okay, well that's... We can put more yellow on. That's doable. But I think I want to kind of block most of this off. Like we can't afford any more dark blue traffic, so this all has to not be... <laughs> This can't spawn any more dark blue, but I do need more yellow uh, down here. So yeah, we want to block all this and basically tell the game, like, this side is not okay unless it's cream. And these three cream, let's see how many cars are being used. One, two, three. So cream's still doing really low population. So I think we can actually cut here and bring this sideways. Kind of like, let's see, this can go this way. So we have three blue for this one. These creams go through here somewhere. <laughs> uh, down, probably. Probably using like a downward interruption through here. Uh, maybe just a crossroad. Just a straight up crossroad through here. Just like that, and then through here. That's It's super messy, and I said like I don't want to turn left here, but I think we have to. And I like a blue to spawn here. That would be great. Dark blue, okay. A bit more cream, that's super good. Um, let's pull this road one more to the left. So we can get one more. Oh no, we can actually just leave it. Uh, yeah, that's fine. What if we get more cream in here? Yeah, like that. I'll use the bridge to connect more in. So pop those, pop that, cool. Uh, now we're gonna have a lot of cream coming through here, so I want to make it so that there's less interruption for dark blue. This is already a huge traffic jam. Let's move this off of that line. If we do, or maybe just like one here to keep this population down and then three down to here. So those probably go there, <laughs> probably most of the time. And this can cut closer because why are we wasting space? This is doing fine. There's lots of yellow in reserve. So I think I'll even pop this one that way. And do I need this road anymore? I don't think so. No, because that was for the other stuff. Or even just say, like, this one goes that way. So there's less blue on this line. Yeah, that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> We're ticking up on dark blue. It's going to be close. I think we're going to get pretty high on the scoreboard, but this is... Yeah, look, look at this traffic jam. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, how do you, how do you untraffic that? Legit, I think it's just make the blues go all the way around. Like, all of this needs to not go that way. <laughs> it needs to go all the way around. Like, down and in through here. Does that even make sense? I don't think that makes sense. I think we might just be euchred. <laughs> this might just be the end. I mean, we'll see how it goes, but I think this might be... 
This might be the end. Yep. We've got three pips over here and no cars. We've got two cars going? Yeah, it's... These three green, these four greens, oh my gosh, yeah. These greens are breaking traffic. Um, They can go onto this line, that's better. They should have gone on that line a long time ago. I think that's GG. Thousand, that's pretty good. <laughs> oh, 49 days, a thousand. That's probably the lowest score in a long time. Okay, so long term, the short term fix, or sorry, what I should have done a long time ago is move all these greens onto its own line. Yeah. And then maybe, maybe something down here is broken. I should have maybe sacrificed some of this space to put in an, a road to go around, like a road that goes all the way around. Like a, a bypass almost. This white would have helped here, so that was probably safe. But these greens blocking traffic here. Like, imagine the, all these greens not being here and just being trying to go left and right here. That would have helped a lot. But yeah, this is a this is a tough challenge. I think we really nailed the start. Like this this whole like side is perfect. Like, look at that. These ones are still fine. This one's fine. This green. Ah, uh, these trees got in the way. I think if I had a road that went through here, I could have done something, or maybe blocked this yellow from spawning. That was another big one. That was a big uh, shot in the foot to lose all these highway locations. But either way, that was good. That felt clean. Most of the map, other than the cross map dark blue, I think that was the other thing. If we blocked all this off so that nothing could spawn up here, that would have been ideal. That would have probably propelled us right into the top. Because yeah, either imagine no green going along this, or no dark blue. <laughs> And that would have just, like, if, if the dark blue spawned either in here, in this, like, double destination, or this double destination because it's forced to spawn somewhere, and then it's just a quick path, yeah, okay, yeah, <laughs> I think that was the actual solution. All of the rest is probably good. And, like, all the decisions of knowing the color masks and knowing where to put the extra creams or block so I know where the creams will spawn next, that's that was super important. Like, down here... Down here, having like this little road so that I get a certain number of creams to go this way, and then having the rest spawn in here so this can be served better. Okay, that was perfect. <laughs> I'm not perfect at a lot of things, but that was really smart. I'll think about this one. This was an interesting one, and I don't know if there's much to do better other than like cheat the game more, but I don't know how the game interacts with just not being able to spawn a color. But 1007 is our score, top 4%. So I betcha, I betcha some people thought about that. <laughs> I'm happy with that. That's 200. Uh, definitely one of the toughest ones. I wish I saw who was in first place. I should have checked that before we, uh, before I started. I guess we can check. Uh, 5,000. Yeah. So I bet your Ernie Steak saw that and he's like, no, no, no. We're not, we're not doing that. We are getting rid of dark blue early and making it spawn on the left. Who knows? Who really knows? I'm happy with my score and I hope it inspires you to try this crazy, yes, number 10th, crazy 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 weekly challenge outside of that thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one